I want to play this and record my data into MIDI workstation. So what I need to do is set this to virtual port 1. That's how it's going to communicate. So this is set up. I can close that. I go back to the MIDI workstation. Now, here is the here's some of the things that people always get confused about. I see it on the forum all the time. You go up here, you're going to right click. It's it's saying what what this is output. So what it means is the data that's recorded in here where is it going to go is it going to go out to my profile is it going to go to my dm10 or is it going to go out to vst virtual port which is now we know is hooked to hooked up to the piano vst that i have plugged in on uh, track one in saw studio so that's where it's going to go and it's going to be on channel one okay now this is the key you have to right click here for the input. So what is going to play? What are you going to play that MIDI workstation is going to record? Well, I'm not playing my DM10. I'm playing my Axiom because it's a it's a it's a MIDI keyboard and that's what I need for the piano. So, I just do that. Let's uh, go live and suddenly it works. And if I want to record it, now I press record. And I've just recorded all, that's exactly what I, I recorded. Now I can stop record, hit the space bar and If I want to edit this, I can. And that's that's it. It's that simple. Uh, just remember, here's your output. See, it's important that you name it, like I said, so you always get the reference. Because if you don't name it here, I mean up here, and you're out here, y y it can get confusing. You can lose track of what is that the input or is that the output? You know, well, if you name it there, when you right click here, you select the port and you automatically know this is the output. This is what MIDI workstation, this data right here, it, this data is now being output to this VST module via. MIDI workstation virtual port one. See how it all comes together once you, you just get a little grip on it. And to find out what your input, the where, where did this data come from? Well, it came from, right click there, it came from my Axiom. And here's another thing. It, when you see, you, you right click this, you see it says port one, port two. The one you use the most, you should put on port one. Most people are only going to have one. I have two. Some people might have four or five. They can have this, you know, up to twenty-four. Um, make sure you put the most, the one you use the most, because it's going to be the default one, I think. But and that that's pretty much it. And uh, I really hope it helps out people and have fun recording in MIDI workstation.